I am no one, Gabrielle. I have no sparkles. Hi, guys. And we're going to have a little fun today. I feel like we're in for something really good. <laughs> she looks dangerous and fun. <laughs> right on. Hi, guys. This is Played Again. I'm Ginger. And I'm Mike. And do you remember, Ginger, we recently discovered Dimas Sonopati? Yes, he, we, doing... he did a Linkin Park song. Yeah, and it, and it was so good. It was really good. <laughs> I loved it. So we're, we're back again. Yeah, so I, I just... found one that's new on his <laughs> channel. For a, it's an air supply cover. <laughs> I, I tried to wrap my head around somebody covering both Linkin Park and air supply. Right? Is it making love out of nothing at all? No, it's not. It's a song called Goodbye, which I'm not sure that I actually know. No, I don't think I do. Oh, well, maybe once we hear it, we will. It's been a lot of years, guys, since I listened to Air Supply. Yeah, and since <laughs> listened to Mom and Dad's AM radio, really. Right? It's been a long time. <laughs> so let's give it a shot. It's brave, though, because Air Supply is tough to cover, I think. see the pain living in your eyes and I know how hard you try you deserve to have so much more I can feel your heart and I sympathize and I'll never criticize all you've ever meant to my life I don't want to let you down Sounds so much like him. Oh, oh 
my God. I can't believe how much she sounded like him. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure if we heard them back to back, you could tell that they're different. But if I haven't heard much air supply in like 40 years. And, and if you'd taken that chorus and played it to me and said, there's air supply, I would have said, yeah, of course. It sounded the, well, it's a lot like him to me. Yeah, for oh, real. Oh, I'm sure some of our Australian peeps will argue, but you guys got to admit, that was amazing how much he sounded like. Yeah. What's the name of the lead singer from Richard something? Hitchcock? Russell. Russell Hitchcock. I don't Sorry, know, guys. I it's it's literally supply. been almost 40 years for me, too. Yeah. But uh, his voice is so distinctive that I don't forget, right? Yeah, like yeah. he has a really unique voice. And oh my God, I can't believe how. I'm still blown away. It was very air supply. It was beautiful, though. <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't remember that song because no, I don't know if maybe. I've ever actually heard it before, but uh, wow. Maybe that one wasn't a hit in Canada when we were growing up. Could be. Mm -hmm. Could be. We got sheltered a lot, guys. Uh, the radio in Canada doesn't let us, didn't let us listen to a lot when we were young. So. Wow, though. He sounded so good. He did. Right? Yeah. And actually, the <laughs> instrumentation was really good, too. Yeah, I was, it's, it's when really that bass pretty. came in, I was like, oh, that sounds really good. Yeah, so the whole there thing. you go. One one artist covering Linkin Park and Air Supply. Successfully. Successfully. Doing wow. It well. Yeah, I <laughs> That's am. That's amazing. This, like, golf clap and everything, right? That was outstanding. Yeah, I'm. I should pull. We should pull up the original and see what it sounds like. But I, oh, I'm pretty sure you're right that if you played them side by side, it would still be hard to tell. Mm. That was really amazing. Anyway, hopefully you all enjoyed that too. Uh, don't roast me too hard if you're a Air Supply fan. And in the meantime, play it again. If for no other reason than to compare. Is ginger good roasted? Um, please don't try. <laughs> Or does it get stuck in your... <laughs> Ginger's got the practical question. <laughs> I'll hold your upper part still while you shake, baby. Help you learn. <laughs> the coconut just fell right behind us. You good, bro. And we go doot.